Okay, today I picked up some fresh corn on the cob and we're going to make that uh, using the Hamilton Beach Digital Steamer. And these are fresh and when they're done, after they're in the steamer for about 25 minutes, they are so delicious. They're sweet, they're um, crunchy, and they are so good. So we're going to get started. I've already removed one uh, corn on the cob or corn from the husk and it's really easy it's just taking off the husks and getting it ready for the steamer I've already filled up uh, the water level which is very close to max on the steamer here yeah just removing that all it's just nice fresh Corn. And it is going to taste so good. So delicious. Okay, try to get everything off. I would probably do this over the sink or the trash can. See, <laughs> it's getting all messy. But you want to remove as much as you can. And then, okay, that looks good. Um, like I said, we've already put. Uh, the, close to the max of water in the reservoir. This is a two layer uh, steamer, so we're going to remove this part. This part here is for uh, making steamed rice, that little bowl there, so we don't need that. We're going to remove the lid, and um, this part also comes off so that we can stand uh, the corn. I'm only making two pieces because it's just me. Uh, right now, hubby's at work, and uh, I wanted to show you how easy and delicious this is. So I'm going to put this in like that, and then I'm going to get the lid, put that on. Okay, we're going to plug it in, and we're going to press the on button. It's set at 20, we're going to use the up arrow to go up to 25. Oops, we went up one, so we'll use a down arrow. And it'll start stop blinking, and when it does, it oh, it will start cooking. So now it's switched, it's on the cook. Um, the first one is delay time, so if you put something in there, say the rice, if you wanted to delay it until, uh, say, 45 minutes before you got home from work, then you can do that, and then the rice will be ready when you get home. After this is done, after it goes to 25 minutes, then it'll switch over to warm. So no worries, if you hear it beep, you know that it'll still be warm. Um, you can hear it already starting to you know, steam up that water or heat up that water so the steam come up. I'm going to switch the lid this way so that the steam, these little two holes here, the steam comes out this way. And it'll take about 25 minutes and when it's done, I'll come back and then we'll dig in. We'll take a big bite with some butter and salt and pepper and I'll show you what it looks like. The corn on a, the cob smells delicious. It smells so good. We have less than a minute left and as soon as it beeps, I'm gonna go ahead and remove it, put some butter on, a little bit of salt and take, there it goes. It's done. It is done. And you can see by the, this red um, light here it switched over to warm so it'll keep your meal warm um, if needed if you can't get to it right away but it switched and it'll keep it warm up to one hour uh, so that's good uh, to know so we're going to go ahead and take the lid off and have a taste of this corn on the cob so you want to be careful this is not hot uh, but the steam coming up is hot so we'll set that down and then um, Grab this one here. It look delicious. This is super hot. Uh, I'm not sure if I would be able to take a bite into this. I might have to wait a couple of minutes because this is super hot. The, the corn on the cob is going to be nice and uh, oh, look, that's melting really nice. It's going to be nice. A little bit of salt there. Let me see if I can take a bite and you can hear the little crunch. 
don't know if I'll be able to. Maybe I can use this here. Oh, this is just too hot. Uh, let's wait like five minutes and maybe a couple minutes and we'll get back to it. I'll come back to it. Giving it some time to cool down. I'm going to go ahead and take a bite. Uh, I've already added butter and some salt. Ooh, it still just melts. Oh my God. Let's see. Mm. Oh, this tastes so good. This is white corn, um, yellow corn and white corn, they're both sweet. There's no big difference as far as taste. Um, this just tastes delicious. Mm, mm, mm. It's very good. Mm. Oh, I love it. Very sweet. Nice and hot, butter and salt. It's delicious. I hope you like this video. Also, I put, uh, if you're interested in how I make steamed rice, I'll put the link below. Also, making tamales on this steamer and fried rice, which comes out great without the oil. Okay, if you're interested in that, use the links below. I'm going to go ahead and turn this off. Um, Thanks again for watching. If you can please like, share, and subscribe. Appreciate it. Thank you. Bye-bye.